As parents, we all want our children to become excellent students, but sometimes our kids experience setbacks on their academic journey. How do you know when it's time to find a tutor to help your child get back on track? Stay tuned for more info. Before we jump into it, make sure to give us a like, follow, and comment if you enjoyed this content. And make sure to check out our other TinnyTube video here where we cover the do's and don'ts of high dosage tutoring. While we all want our children to become independent learners, sometimes it becomes apparent that a child needs a little boost to help them achieve their potential. Tutoring is a great way to give your child an academic boost. What are the signs that your child might need a tutor? First, probably the most objective way to see that your child needs a tutor is slipping grades. Not every child will be a straight A student, but when an A student becomes a B student or a B student becomes a C student, you may need to consider a tutor for your child. Second, it's not hard for parents of elementary school kids to help their child with their homework, but eventually students are gonna get into content that a parent cannot remember. When your child is taking upper level coursework, you can no longer remember and may be another sign that your child needs a tutor. Third, sometimes a student struggles not from lack of ability, but from lack of confidence. They're also unsure of themselves and they may get stuck with content they need to complete and move past. It can be hard to get a reassurance from other students or even parents, but time spent with a tutor can often shore up confidence. Another problem, especially common among middle school students, is lack of organization. They're capable of doing the work, they just don't have a system down for allowing them to keep track of their work and know what needs to be done with confidence. Sometimes a parent-child relationship gets to the point where it's better to have a tutor come in and help your child with organization than attempting to help them as a parent. This leads us to our fifth sign. Sometimes parents can, are still capable of helping their child with studies, but if helping is causing a conflict with your child, it's probably not worth it to help them yourselves. Your relationship with your child is the most important thing, and it may be worthwhile to hire a tutor or professional to help in order to preserve your personal relationship. Finally, as mentioned in a previous TinnyTube, tutoring is not always for remediation. Sometimes you should look to get a tutor for your child to help them achieve their academic potential. Studies show that students engaged in high dosage tutoring in particular will advance in their academic performance no matter what the academic achievement level of the student is. Pursuing a tutor for your child can seem like an overwhelming and expensive task. In reality, tutoring is one of the cheapest interventions to allow your child to achieve their academic potential. And the process to find a tutor need not be daunting. If a tutor is not available in your neighborhood, there are many online tutoring services available, like tinnytutors.com, which can help your student no matter where they live. We hope that you have found this episode of TinnyTube helpful in covering some of the signs that your child may need tutoring. As always, be sure to hit that like and subscribe and click the bell icon to be reminded whenever we post a new video. Make sure to check out all the links in the description if you're curious about us or the other content that we have posted. See you on the next one.